Good morning. I am high tech today. I am so excited. I did a software update and like, I don't even have to get up and push the button. I can say the, I'm not going to say it because what if it stops recording? I better not. Okay. Um, and, uh, yeah, so I'm learning new things. I mean, I could just sit here and say something and then my phone actually records it. So how awesome is that? Oh my goodness, that's craziness, right? Today is December 17th, and Care Bear's got a very annoying toy. Care Bear, come here. No, no, no crinkly noises, right? Right? Yeah, come here. Come here. Come see what Mama's got. Come see what Mama's got. Yeah, come see what Mama's got. There you go. Yes, lay on my lap so we can do this. Okay, today is December 17th. Yes, I love you too. I love you too. Yes, I do. Okay, and we are reading from Be Still and Know. It says, Freedom to Soar. <laughs> it is for freedom that Christ has set us free. That's Galatians 5.1. Freedom is a wonderful thing. We live in a free country where we can worship God, speak our minds, and enjoy unlimited opportunities without fear or restraint. Yet, in spite of all these liberties, we sometimes feel bound to the humdrum routine of daily life, somewhat like a hamster in its wheel. There seems to be no way of escaping the routine of joyless living. This is not God's plan for us. Life naturally consists of responsibilities that can seem relentless, but we can simultaneously soar like eagles in joyful freedom. Are you feeling trapped by routine today? Take a moment and fix your eyes on Jesus. Soak in his presence. Feel the spark of divine life that was ignited in you when you first surrendered your heart to him. Thank him for freedom from sin, fear, bondage, and hopelessness. It was for freedom that Christ set us free. Lord, thank you for the incredible gift of freedom, both in my country and in my soul. Help me face my past today with joy and set my spirit free. We have a lot of freedom in the United States. A lot of other countries do not have that freedom. Some people have to hide, um, you know, in places and share Bibles and rip pages out of Bibles just to read a word of God. And, you know, but we have this ultimate freedom and we take it for granted. We really do. We do. And, you know, um, one of the things is, is that I do a lot. I do. Um, you know, I mean, I got my Sunday school. I'm a Sunday school teacher. You know, I'm involved in the church community. Um, I work full-time. I go to school full-time. I, you know what I mean? I do all these things and I'm doing more, you know what I mean? I want to, you know, save children. I want to do all this stuff because, you know, my heart, that's where my heart's at and that's where God put my heart at. And, but I have freedom. I have joy. And sometimes, you know, I sit here and I'm just like, I'm doing too much because it's just chaotic and it goes, 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 go. And I don't, like half the times, you know, during the week, I don't have time to just sit down for a half hour. I don't. And yesterday, yesterday, I, I just laid on my couch and watched Christmas movies. I felt weird. I definitely felt weird because I don't do that. But it felt so good. And I ate, ate chips and dip. But I, I ate guacamole dip and I ate, you know, some um, Tostitos, which is less carbs. So I'm still trying to eat healthy while I'm like, you know, doing the relaxed day because we need to relax. And, you know, I woke up so grateful today, just like, you know, just like cleansed and just to take that day of relax, like just to do that. I mean, when is the last time you relaxed? When is the last time that you just sat there and laid on your couch and watched Christmas movies? I mean, there were good Christmas movies too. Um. Yeah, but when is the last time? I mean, have you watched Candy Cane Lane with Eddie Murphy? That's what I watched. It was so cute. Oh, um, but when is the last time you did that? You know what I mean? Like, can you just take a day and be joyful? 
or is your life so busy that you don't even have a day? I mean, you can make a day for you just to relax and be in the presence of God. Because God was with me yesterday on my couch. I was just laying there and I felt so much peace. I felt peace. I felt joy. All my animals except Shadow were laying with me. So that that's a miracle in itself right there. But yeah, Shadow, we're going to get her to lay on the couch too. It, it'll take a minute. She's like a shadow. Anyways, but I love you. Have a blessed day. And, and you know what? Find joy today. Find freedom today. Get freedom today. I love you. Have a blessed day. Oh, stop recording. Doesn't work, does it? Stop recording. Do I actually have to? Okay.